Well, and we last spoke at um, Port Vale, um, and that was a, you didn't even lose that, and there was disappointment. That's been a rare blot, really, isn't it, Port Vale? Um, your loan spell's going very well, I dare to say. Yeah, it is. I think, um, obviously, the, the six draws and the spin were quite frustrating at times, but I think when you saw we picked up the points against, they were, they were good points. Um, we could have won a couple more of them, but um, I think the, the result on Saturday obviously makes them very good points, and um, hopefully we can kick on to the end of the season. And to go to Oxford, buzzing after reaching a Wembley final, um, to go there and keep a clean sheet and win 2-0, um, that's quite a result, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. We knew they played Wednesday, so they had a bit um, less recovery time than us. Um, so I think the plan was just to start fast and not, not let them breathe, not let them play football. And I think we did that really well. I thought the, the midfield um, you know, and the front three as well were fantastic for, for the back players. You know, they um, took a lot of pressure off us with their work rate and um, so yeah we scored, ended up scoring two good goals and getting a good result Yeah you're, you're young and um, you've got to keep your feet on the ground but is the loan going better than you expected I mean there, there is rotation at this club but you're you're a regular with Tom Lockyer and of course results going your way as well Yeah I think so I think um, you know we've still got other good defenders in here so if my performance levels drop then I'm sure there's always going to be someone ready to step in so but yeah no it's, just, um, it's going well and hopefully that can continue Have you improved since you first joined the football club? I think so yeah I'm um, you know, I think there's obviously different qualities that I've got to add to my game. But, you know, being aggressive and def trying to defend well is um, something I'm, I pride myself on. And getting clean sheets, so hopefully that can continue. The challenge is to win some games in succession now to maintain a playoff push. Um, how yeah. difficult is that? Is it easy, easier said than done? Um, I think so, but, um, you know, we've got a strong home record. You know, we've got a home game Saturday, so we'll go and look to win that. We'll take it game by game and then hopefully we can string some results together. And I think, you know, if you do that in these sort of leagues, then um, there's no reason why we can't push up that table. Have to be at your best on Saturday. South End are up there as well. Yeah, I think so. Um, I think, if I'm right, they drew 1-1 against Port Vale in their last game. So they'll be looking to to get a result here. But, you know, I think teams will find it tough coming to our place. Um, so I know we've drawn the last couple of homes. So hopefully we can t get a good result Saturday and get the three points. Um, who's going to mark Simon Cox? He's uh, one of the better strikers in League One, isn't he? Yeah, I, th I think so. You know, I think they've got a couple other good players as well, with um, good experience. So I think there's not we can't really just focus on one player. But you know, when when we get the team sheet, we'll um, we'll, we'll obviously put on who's marking who, and we'll we'll defend like we have um, in the last in the recent games. And then um, I think if we do that, then there's no reason why we can't go and get the win. And there is an eventual purpose to this last question. How much are you monitoring your, your current club, Stoke, while you're here at Bristol Rovers? Yeah, no, I always still look out for them and how, how the boys are doing. Um, and obviously they got a good result last night against City. So, yeah, no, obviously I keep a lookout for how they're doing, yeah. To be honest, what game did you watch last night? The Stoke 0 0 draw Man City or Barcelona's 6 1 win against PSG? <laughs> well, I was watching the, the um, Barcelona game until PSG scored and I thought that was it. So I was flicking over and then obviously the Barcelona. Um, Missed out on a couple of goals at the end, so I was a bit disappointed. Like, but now obviously I did watch the Stoke game and got a good result. To be fair.